Cheryl Larson. I work at Allergan and I came here to ClinTech for my very first time, quite exciting, from California. And I was listening to Metadata's presentation on the CTMS in the cloud, exciting stuff. Um, some of it I, I was a little concerned about. I mean, the, the idea of implementation happening really quickly, you know, you plug it in and off you go, and I'm thinking, well, yeah, but what if you're already involved in a CTMS and you have, you know, so much work to do to, to turn over and become, you know, a customer, what's the real time frame in, you know, starting off and saying, yeah, we'd like to do this, to actually being able to transfer and figure out all your stuff and move to the next thing? Mm. Good question. Thanks. Uh, all our clients ask us that, so it depends, I'm afraid is the answer. Um, it's good if you your organization is CTMS savvy. Mm. It means they already have some level of understanding. Uh, it somewhat depends on how standardized the groups and the processes are, how much effort there is on the client side, and we help the client to get people onto a consistent way of working. Um, and then the other consideration is how was your old system set up? Did everybody get everything they wanted? Did they customize it? Did they absolutely get every little screen changed? Because our approach is quite the opposite. We say, here's a working CTMS. We'll begin with the working system and we'll figure out in which steps to get your team live. And then I think the second part to how long it takes. So let me answer your question and not just avoid <laughs> it. A smallish company can do it in eight to 12 weeks uh, with a good scope and a good team. The bottleneck is on the client side, how quickly can they learn? How quickly can they make decisions? Are they able to do their homework quickly? get uh, lists of centers and doctors ready to upload. That's the bottleneck. A bigger team, there's just more uh, meetings, coordinations, alignment of process, alignment of training. It's a lot more work. So by definition, will take more of the order of six to nine months. Okay. The next big topic would be, what about my data in CTMS? So true. Okay. So. That also depends, and it depends on what you want to do with that. If you have studies that have been in the old CTMS for five years, you've already um, migrated them into a uh, central repository for you know, data mining or reporting, it's not a huge amount of value to moving those into the new CTMS. If you then move to the running studies, if there are studies in your legacy system that are going to finish in three to six months, pretty questionable if you want to disrupt those teams to move them across. If there are brand new studies starting, that's also easy. So that almost done and the new ones, pretty easy. Start the new ones in the new CTMS. It's more the longer running studies that uh, we spend time with clients getting the data out of the old system and up into the new system. So I don't know if that... That addresses my question. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Good. Thanks.